Hello and welcome back to day two of CPHI Frankfurt. We're here with Valsenez and Max Lauriner, the new Senior Vice President. Hello Max and welcome. Hello. Thank you very much for taking the time to talk to us today. So, you joined the company very recently in June. Congratulations on the new role. Thank you. Can you tell me a bit about your mission and why you were brought on board? The SSC Group has a two-leg strategy. One is the traditional explosive business and one is fine chemicals. And I have a 25 years background in fine chemicals, starting from process development, manufacturing, business development. So I felt well equipped for uh, taking that challenge and that role. And I, when I read about the uh, refreshing claim of Valsintes about let's grow together, that made me curious. And so I applied for the job and the position as heading the Valsintes business unit. And after the talks with the board of directors, with the management, the CEO, I was really excited about the corporate culture. We are small, we are agile, we are entrepreneurial, and we really can make the difference and get our customers successful. Thank you. I'm sure the team's excited to have you on board too. So, Valsenid said your hiring signal is a further step in the development of fine chemicals business, in addition to a recent strategic partnership with Royal DSM. What are your key goals for continued growth of the fine chemicals division over the next two to five years, and will it involve further partnerships? Well, Walsintes, or the SEC Group, has invested quite significantly in the recent past, past years, in our capabilities, in small-scale production facilities, in development capabilities, but also in analytical development and quality control and quality assurance abilities. That is a prerequisite for being successful as a modern CDMO uh, offerer of development and production services. With uh, having said that, uh, the group was very successful in uh, increasing the business, but also in uh, filling the capacities. And that's going to be my mission to continue that suc successful growth path, but also to secure sufficient capacities for the, for the future and for the future growth of the company. Thank you. Well, we wish you all the success in the future. Can you talk to us about new trends in the needs of pharma and chemical industries? Are these new demands what led to the division to expand Valsenith's fine chemicals division? Well, there are three trends which come to my mind uh, immediately. One is certainly that uh, customers in the fine chemical industry, farm industry, are seeking more and more European sources and uh, for, uh, for, uh, for, for their, uh, as their suppliers. Because uh, with the supply disruptions from the, recent, in the, uh, from the past years, I think that supply security and reliability became much more important. Secondly, I think as a CDMO partner, you need to have, or to be, have the ability to offer, besides technology uh, mastership, you need to offer the entire set of capabilities, starting from development, but also manufacturing, including analytical de development, quality control and, and quality assurance, and regulatory support. Third, it's more and more sustainability is getting important, not just for us in uh, Valsintes, but also from our customers. I think we just have one planet uh, to share among all, all of us, and we all need to be mindful with the resources and with the footprint we have, and uh, that's certainly something which uh, is getting more and more in the focus for uh, both us and our customers. I think we are well equipped and well um, set up for meeting these trends and uh, continuing to be successful for both us and the customers. Absolutely, we completely agree. So moving on to talk about the company as a whole, can you talk us through your plans to increase market presence over the next few years? What will this entail? partnerships, building out new or existing facilities? We were successful with the strategy which was set up in improving our capabilities. That has led us to quite a high capacity utilization. We have plans to invest significantly in increasing our large scale manufacturing capabilities at our site in Gamsen. 
That's what we're going to do by our own. Second, we will continue to expand our technology footprint, really to continue to be the specialist in mastering hazardous chemistry. And uh, that's what we are also going to do with partnerships. And for M&A, of course, we are also looking as opportunities come up closely if things make sense. But that's certainly something which will continue to follow on an opportunistic uh, way. Max, thank you very much for talking to us. It's been lovely. Thank you so much and have a good continuation of the show.